Jack Masioka plays what's called an evolved human or Evo on the sci-fi series Heroes Reborn. He has the power to travel through time and to take people with him. By imprisoning me, Erica Kravit bent time for her own benefit. That is a wrong that must be corrected. I will take you back, Noah, to June 13th. But promise me we will not step on any butterflies. Yes, yes, I promise. Just take me back. Okay. Wow. You're back, baby. Yes, thank you. So we were just talking about the set. So I'm not Kevin Costner. <laughs> yes, I'm sorry I'm not Kevin Costner. But to a certain group, you're a hero you are, yeah. from Heroes, and that's a really, really big deal, and you're back on TV. Yes, thank you. It's great to be back. Uh, I love playing the character, and it's just, it's just cool. Yeah. Not everyone gets to revisit a character that they love so much. Yeah. You know, so you must have been excited when they rebooted. Yeah, absolutely. It was, it was great when we got the call. It was like, oh, wow, Heroes is coming back. We all found out actually through a commercial on the, <laughs> on the Winter Olympics. And it was kind of funny. That's how like, you found that's out? How I, I, that's how everyone found out. <gasps> the original cast, we were all like just texting each other. Hey, did you hear about this? Did no, anybody no, no, no. call you? No, but, uh, but after the, the, the commercial aired, we got a call like two hours later from Kim and said, hey, you want to talk? And, well, that was an interesting series because it was uh, so well loved. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, and this is tough business. <laughs> it is, it is. <laughs> you know, everybody thought this, was, this one's a big hit. And then, it was a big hit. Uh, and it was a special hit among certain people. Just the, the, you don't have fans, you know, I don't know, the fanatics, right? right? Okay. So when did the first one go off the air? When did Heroes... I believe 2010. So things have changed quite a bit, especially with social media. Yeah, with social media. Are you noticing that the frenzy is a little different with the, uh, like, for example, on Twitter with your followers and fans? Yeah, definitely. Everyone's, like, talking about it immediately. Because yeah. you have an immediate online community that you could share things and share the experience with. So it's more immediate in that sense, which is very cool. Uh, we read this thing that uh, it's just embarrassing for you. It's reported that your IQ is 180 now. Uh -huh. I, I think Einstein <laughs> topped out about 166. Uh, is that true? It's a lot to carry around. Well, well, it's, that's when I was six, though. And as we know, as we get older, you get <laughs> we dumber? get dumber and dumber and is dumber. <laughs> So my I'm probably running around, hovering around 80 right now. Uh. Well, this, so my goal is to live to be 50, uh, IQ of 50. You've lived long <laughs> enough. Um, you went to, I know you went to Merman School. Yes, I did. You got to be pretty smart to go to Merman School. And then you went to yeah. Brown. Yeah. And you went to Brown and all that You got to be pretty smart to go there. Or I, I, I was a good guesser. Yeah. Or a really good, really good guesser. Did, when did you know that you wanted to be doing this? Uh, it was actually in college. Uh, because throughout high school, I went to uh, high school here as well. And I was doing all math and science stuff. And I realized, Boring. well, for me, it was exciting. <laughs> I love it. There's people who love that. But, I, but at the same time, I think it, it's, you're right. It does make it kind of a boring person in my mind. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to kind of like round out myself and just see what scared me. So it was calculated. It was, it was, it was a, a risk because when you go to college, you have a blank slate. Yeah. Right? Nobody judges you, who you, you are. You reinvent. And you, you reinvent. You so, try something new. Oh, my so. God. Wow. Is this your high school picture? I, I, I think so. Oh was, my goodness! I was young, yes. So when so you came, you went, I think you went to Harvey Westlake. Yes, right? I did. Okay. So you go to Brown, which is in Rhode Island. Were you like the L.A. Hollywood kid when you went there? I was not, because I had no Hollywood connections. You know, my my mom and I came to L.A. when we were six. We have no nothing about Hollywood, mm -hmm. so I never thought about going to acting as a business, because not many Asian American actors were. You know, like growing up, I had Jackie Chan, Bruce Lee, and, uh -huh. and Short Round. That and was that was it. it. When did you realize that this is actually going to be your life rather than something that's fun? Uh, when I got Heroes, because I tried it as kind of on a whim. I was w working for a company called Industrial Light and Magic, and I had a, a fabulous job. I loved what I was doing. And then, you know, I was trying acting out for a little bit and realized, you know, there was really no career for me because there weren't many roles. Mm -hmm. But then when I got and Heroes... Then Hero. Yeah, because it was literally the year I was ready to quit acting is when I got wow. Heroes. So what was that audition like for you? It was just an amazing... Did you, did you know you nailed it? Or? Well, I, I actually did. I think because there's only, you know, there were four rounds, but they were looking for someone who's Japanese, who did comedy, and, you know, who spoke Japanese. And, you know, I've been on NBC 
on like scrubs for recurring roles, so they knew who I was. Yeah. So you were the guy. So it's like, if not this, what else is this? <laughs> like, right? I'm quitting the business if the, this is The isn't. script yeah. almost has my name exactly. in it, right? I, I'm not going to play Batman, you know? So it's like, <laughs> if not this, don't, what else don't is this? Narrow, don't don't narrow the possibilities down. Yeah. Okay. Well, congratulations back in about a Hawaii 5 -0? Yeah, we're still shooting. I'm, you know, commuting to Hawaii. This is our sixth season. Well, that doesn't. One busy not guy. Huh? It's, it's one, uh, that's when I really wish I had, you know, the teleportation power because right? you don't. You don't really. Okay. Right oh, now. you don't really. That's yes. just. I don't. Well, Heroes we'll work on that. Heroes Reborn airs uh, <laughs> Thursday night, eight o'clock on NBC. Pleasure to meet you. Thank you. Thank you, Matthew. So Thank you.